Thanks for tuning in to Staying on Topic. When answering a question in an exam or an assessment task, it's important to stick to a topic and avoid rambling, since irrelevant information will weaken your argument and affect your mark. This video will give you some tips for staying on topic. Firstly, make sure you know exactly what the task involves. Take some time to think about the task you have been set and to organise your thoughts. For tips on how to do this, see our video, Understanding the Assessment Task. After doing some research, decide what your answer to the task will be. Make it into a sentence that states your answer. This sentence will be the main argument of your essay. You should always relate back to this sentence. A tip is to use the content words from the task in your sentence and throughout the essay. This shows the reader that what you're writing is directly related to the task. As you write your essay, keep referring back to this sentence to make sure you remain on topic. You can now plan how you will write your essay. Each idea should connect to your sentence or argument and back to the task. Once you have decided on the key or main ideas you want to discuss, you can then work out how to explain the ideas in two or three paragraphs. Knowing where you are going makes it easier to stay on task. Planning out your essay can also help you make sure that you have enough information or content that relates to the task. Not having enough to write about can lead you to put in irrelevant information simply to pad out the essay or to keep repeating yourself. As you're writing, ask yourself a few questions to check that you are still on topic. Does each sentence relate to the point of the paragraph? If some information doesn't match, then it should be either in a different paragraph or taken out altogether. Don't give the markers irrelevant information. Also, ask yourself if each paragraph relates to the key idea and if that idea links to your argument. Finally, is anything unnecessarily repeated? Sometimes repetition of a point can be useful, such as when it's extended or related to something else, but repetition without adding anything makes you sound disorganised. When you've written a draft, ask someone to proofread it, or leave it for a few days and reread it yourself. Keep asking yourself if there are connections between the elements in this diagram. If at any point you question a connection, then you may have to rewrite or edit out this section. I hope this video has given you some helpful tips on staying on topic. For more handy hints on studying at uni, check out the other videos in our TuneIn series.